Hello, everyone. This is the World Chocolate Masters Final Day 2. And we are here live in Paris from Salon du Chocolat and live with A. 18 finalists coming from 18 different countries and you dear chocolate lovers are going to witness something very special because after four chocolate assignments hashtag wow hashtag share hashtag taste and hashtag bonbon well now we are going to listen to a power speech about a more personal creative journey of the contestant called hashtag you so each of our contestants will have one minute to impress the jury and after that, we are counting the score. So let's give it up for our first contestant. And he's coming from Greece, Nicolas Nikolakopoulos. <laughs> yes, yes, Nicola, ready? Yes. Okay, so let's start the clock and let's listen to your power speech. Two, one, go. Everything good starts with someone's dream. Many years ago, I moved from the world of chemistry to the enchanting world of chocolate. For me, I loved making people love, love when they eat chocolate, lose themselves in chocolate bliss. And uh, for me, the most important part is that chocolate ignites sweet childhood memories and connects us with a playful, optimistic side that we need for the future. Chocolate for me is the way to inspire people, innovate and express myself. It it makes our ideas connect to tomorrow's limitless potential. How? By creating delights that are far from being a guilty pleasure. Delights that provide regeneration, pure joy. Preserve what is good today. Educate on powerful ingredients and also support healthy choices for body and mind. The chocolate of tomorrow is made by dreamers, for dreamers, all of us. Thank you very much. Wow, wow, wow. What a good start. Yes, Anna, it's up to you. Anna from uh, Italy. Three, two, one, go ahead. Excuse me, I don't speak English. Gen Z, la, genera la Gen Z è il futuro. Green, vogliono cambiare le cose e tengono ai cambiamenti climatici. Sustainability. Scelgono uno stile di vita sostenibile. Share the experience. Nati nell'era digitale, condividono la loro vita quotidiana. Inclusivity. Sono inclusivi e non temono diversità. Uniqueness. L'imperfezione è la loro unicità. Break the mold. Rompono gli schemi e sono liberi. Kaleidoscopic. Sono kaleidoscopici e cambiano continuamente. Gender fluid. Sono fluidi e in evoluzione. Design. I miei lavori hanno un fil rouge che è il filo conduttore di tutta la mia creazione. Yes, yes, and I see that Stephen from UK is totally ready to start his presentation. Let's do this, Stephen. Here we go, three, two, one. So my theme for the World Chocolate Masters was love local. As a child, I grew up in North Yorkshire with my father collecting butterflies and moths. My father always told me as a child, I was always interested in the most exotic species from South America or from Papua New Guinea and I found the, the ones near where I lived, they were boring colors and I, I showed little interest. But growing up, as I got older, he taught me to look closer and when I did, I found them more interesting. When we were hit by the pandemic a few years ago, I was forced to look closer at home with my business. And when I found there was other producers and suppliers in my local county of North Yorkshire uh, that, um, that produced not only amazing produce that you've seen in my creations today, the strawberries, which is seven miles from my house, the whiskey that comes from a farm that was completely self-sufficient in the UK. They bore their own water, generate their own electricity, and grow their own grain to make the whiskey. This was so important to me and my journey for the World Chocolate Masters. Thank you so much.
Yes, yes, yes. Working with local products. Maybe it goes the same for Carlo Midiri from the Netherlands. Carlo, ready to do this? Three, yes. two, one, start. Did you ever stop to notice this crying earth, this weeping shores? When I see all the pollution, every piece of plastic, I think to myself, why aren't we taking better care of this world? She's crying, but how can she cry without lungs? The rainforests are the lungs of the earth. The trees and the leaves represent the visual health track throughout my presentation. Uh, I appreciate the things the earth brings. One of my favorites, the sea buckthorn berry, is the most extraordinary taste I ever experienced. I cherish this small berry, just like ants cherish their cargo. They care and carry my unique bonbon throughout my presentation, my showpiece. Be like an ant. Take action and save our planet. Carry and carrying. Now it's up to France and Antoine uh, Garaïc. Vous êtes prêt, Antoine? Oui, eh bien, sure. on y va. 3, 2, 1, top chrono. Alors, pour représenter le thème euh, Tomorrow, je me suis inspiré de la culture des microalgues. Cette innovation permet euh, à la fois de créer des carburants et aussi des produits alimentaires. Euh, cette culture se fait dans une multitude de tubes que j'ai décidé de représenter dans la pièce de vitrine. Euh, cette, euh, ces algues grandissent dans l'eau, d'où la forme de mon bonbon qui représente une goutte d'eau qui tombe sur un galet. Euh, comme thème, j'ai choisi la passion locale. C'était pour moi important de représenter euh, les produits locaux, les produits de ma région, euh, en sélectionnant des, des producteurs qui sont soucieux de l'environnement, qui n'utilisent pas de pesticides et des produits de saison. C'est euh, pour moi une manière aussi de limiter euh, l'impact sur l'environnement et le transport en faisant apporter des, des produits euh, de différentes... Euh, de différents pays. Donc euh, je pense que, que ce concours est aussi un, un bon moyen pour, euh, pour faire passer le message et, euh, de respecter l'environnement. Merci. Merci pour ce joli message, la France. Uh, and here we go uh, back to uh, Korea. And Dung Suk Kim, looking forward to his story. Start. 자연은 모든 것을 시작이며 기초가 됩니다. 그래서 저는 자연처럼 가장 단순하고 본질적인 것이 기본이 되고 가장 큰 힘을 가지고 있다고 생각합니다. 어, 이러한 영감은 미래의 디저트에 대한 새로운 식문화를 표현하기 위해 선과 면의 조화를 이룬 디자인으로 풀어냈습니다. 요즘 사람들은 건강을 원하면서도 맛있는 음식을 즐기는 것을 추구합니다. 한국에서 음식과 건강, 업사이클링 연구의 선구자인 경희대 박 교수에게 배운 덕분에 와인 제조 후 버려지는 포도씨를 업사이클링해 얻은 폴리페놀을 사용하여 혈관 콜레스테롤 수출을 낮추는 디저트를 얻어서도 아이디어를 떠올렸습니다. 또한 카카오만으로 부족한 폴리페놀 함량을 채울 수 있어 건강에 더욱 도움이 될 것입니다. 저는 건강, 맛, 그리고 환경을 모두 지키는 디저트를 만들어 여기나 죽일 수 있는 사, 제품을 상용화할 것입니다. Thank you very much, Korea. And now up to Morocco and Issam Tahir. So, salam alaikum, are you ready? Bonsoir. Yes, bonsoir. On y va. 3, 2, 1, c'est parti. Ayant grandi dans une ville secondaire de Maroc, à peine Oujda, se fait face de nombreux défis pour trouver un chemin pour moi dans ma vie. C'est un défi pour moi et pour tous les enfants pour que je grande. À ce moment, je me suis toujours dit que point de ce changement du jour d'avoir accès à l'énergie propre et pour apprécier les autres sur ma vie et sur la vie de notre dans les endroits similaires. D'abord, nous n'avons pas de problème avec les clients naturels comme avant, on utilisait des panneaux solaires par aliment et ce montant d'impact d'utilisation de l'énergie. Votre voie renouvelable à la voie, à la voie dans la production de notre planète et dans la croissance de l'amélioration génération pour l'avenir. 
And now, ladies and gentlemen, up to Spain and Luque Carachelias with his presentation. And go! For me, participating in this World Show of the Masters has been a challenge, not only as a person, but also as a professional, but above all, I would say that if I came here, it was to bring to the sector, to bring to the conscience, and above all, to understand what we're doing with the planet, to try to bring forms organic, textures the maximum worked, and to try to make everything make sense and fight in all the senses. To be able to work with the product of proximity, with products proper, and that everything that you did in every moment had a sense. A més a més, també, res d'això hauria estat possible si no hagués estat pel gran equip, perquè el treball amb equip sempre suma i l'he volgut reflectir també en totes les proves, en cada moment que ha passat. Per tant, crec que tot el treball, tot el fil conductor que uneix totes les proves d'aquest World Chocolate Masters ha estat un treball molt dur, molt complet, però que estic supersatisfet. Thank you, Spain. Now up to Japan and Jiro Tanaka. Are you ready? Yes? Yeah. Okay, we two, three, two, one, and start. My tomorrow will change the world of sweets and create worldwide pandemic of smiles. I realized that deliciousness was paramount after the tragic death of a friend to cancer. Her last smile came from a bite of one of my cakes People with special dietary needs or those just going through a hard time have to think about what they can eat rather than what they want to eat. Allowing everyone to eat customized but always delicious product is the elegance in sweets industry lacks. As a professional, we have a responsibility to bring happiness by catering to everyone's tastes and needs. Sweets have to be delicious and elegant. This is why Delegant was born. Bring a smile to everyone in any situation. Tomorrow must become Delegant. Thank you. And thank you for this Delegant presentation. Next up is uh, Igor Zarechki from uh, Poland. You can start right now. My name is Sigurd Zaritsky. I am pastry chef in the Warsaw Academy of Pastry Arts. We are introducing students to the world of taste, colors, and composition. That is Warsaw, a modern and very comfortable city where there is a lot of place to relax with my family. This is my academy where I work it on creating new techniques, taste, and arts. Those are my kids, Amelia and Leon. I get my inspiration from them. They recharge my power. We have fun by doing sports and exploring the culture together. That's the war. Brutal and tragic events. Something of innocent Ukrainians are being killed by Russian terrorists. But lights win out of the darkness. Law wins of evil and Ukraine will win with the help all the good people, those people, it fill me with the energy and the hope for the better tomorrow where there is no place for the war, only for the love and peace. Come on! Well, talking about a power speech and in meanwhile coming on stage from the United Arab Emirates, give it up for Dilip. Ready, Dilip? Yes. yes. Three, yes. two, one, go. Renewable is the key for the sustainability. For our Mother Earth, everything is naturally powered by the sun. But we are forgetting it because we are using only natural energy, 13% from the Earth. We have to go for the 100. Yes, we can. Through that, we can reduce the carbon footprint gift made by us, sea waves, Wind, heat of the sun, these all are the gift to use energy with minimal effect to the planet. And with those, we can build a better tomorrow. Humankind and to the whole planet, let us use our technology, protect our world. And we can use for the natural energy from the earth to save our planet for the future.
Thank you. Thank you very much, Dilip. And next, ready on stage, is Nishan from Canada. Let's do the countdown. Three, two, one, yes. So inspiration for me comes to media these days. It's from social media, but when you, when you go out to farmer's market, or even if, in the, if it's in the nature. So my inspiration comes from my living with type 1 diabetes. When I was diagnosed with it, I was forced to have a healthy lifestyle, and that pushed me to become a hiker. And while hiking through the beautiful Canadian Rockies, I found my love for wild ingredients. That's where the birth syrup comes into my bonbon. But that also gave me inspiration of how these small berries, the fresh fruit or the freshness of each and every ingredient comes into place. And I think working with the local restaurant, uh, farmers and chefs are the only ones who can actually change this environment and make it more sustainable. And for that, we need to work together. Uh, the only vision for tomorrow is me being better every day and inspiring chefs and the type 1 diabetic community that's around us. And that will only come through sustainability and fresh ingredients. Wow, wow, wow. Thank you for sharing a very personal, uh, healthy story also. Next up is someone who also likes to work with local ingredients from Hungary, ladies and gentlemen. Attila, you ready? Yes. yes. Then here we go, start. When I became a pastry chef 25 years ago, I was motivated to create something that is important and tell a story and it will be valuable even tomorrow. I left my homeland and I spent many years abroad gathering inspiration, but I never lost focus. When I returned home, I realized the essence of pastry art had always been with me. This is my home, past, present and future. This is local love. With the perfect chocolate pairings, I wanted to bring to life the treasures of Hungary and introduce the producers without the cliches. The sweet asu from Tokai, the chamomile from Hortobai, the walnuts and the rice. For me, that's the key. I believe that anyone who tastes, hears, sees and smells the stories of my desserts will not only discover the new face of Hungary, but the importance of their own roots. Because this is what makes tomorrow truly precious. Thank you very much. Wow, wow. Thank you for sharing this local love. The next one has been sharing snowflakes. Are you ready? Irvo from Finland. Here we go. Three, two, one, start. The choices that we make, the ingredients and recipes you, we use today affect what we will have tomorrow. I've used xylitol and okarami in my creations, the byproducts of oat, which we produce in the house of Fatsar. From waste to heroes. Growing up, I was surrounded by nature, enjoying the four seasons, which have inspired my work. I mix chocolate with natural, earthy flavors, such as fruits and grape. The snowflake that ties my creations together is symbolic to the purity of nature. Water in all its forms is vital for life, vital for everything. Sustainable and recyclable choices equip us to take care of nature and help its renewal. I want to make a difference in the environment for our children and their children Tomorrow's grown-ups. Let's treasure tomorrow like it's a delicate snowflake. Thank you. Wow, wow, so interesting, these personal stories. Here comes Greater China and uh, Jackie Lung. Jackie, everything okay? Yes, and here we go. Three, two, one, start. 我們在香港過來 究竟大自然的基本和馬文化會不會有人仲記得這個是很重要的明天之後我們要很多可持續發展的食物不是地球就會越來越辛苦和好忙 we are from Hong Kong! 
Yeah, chocolate is indeed all about emotions. Next coming up is Togo from Belgium. Togo, yes. Ready to go? Three, two, one, let's do this. Hello, everyone. So my wish is simple. I would like us all to take an interesting problem faced by the planet we live on. A number of us have and are already taking action, but not everybody is. We must all have the same level of awareness, understanding, and action. We can no longer look away from environmental problems. Even if it may appear difficult to initiate major change without commitment of state and big companies, we are still individually involved as inhabitants and workers in the system. The solution is simple. If each one of us learns and acts, the world will change. Thank you very much. Merci beaucoup. Arigatou gozaimashita. Let's bring the action also from Switzerland. He has been sharing a nice views. Abraham, here you go. It's your moment. Start. Uh, buenas tardes a todos. Uh, nos hemos acostumbrado a ver productos de todo el mundo en nuestros mercados más cercanos. Soy Abraham Balaguer, representante de Suiza, y mi trabajo está inspirado por productores y granjeros locales. Cada día veo como los mercados ignoran las estaciones y los productos regionales. El mañana debería estar construido por personas del territorio que lo conocen y lo entienden. Ellos trabajan con rigor y compromiso, respetan el paisaje y lo hacen con honestidad. Yo he puesto mi experiencia en diferentes sectores del servicio del mañana. Mañana empieza hoy sobre los cimientos del ayer. Bueno, yo quiero agradecer a todo el equipo que me ha ayudado de confiseguir. Voy a... What a beautiful story. Then it's up to USA and Christophe Rule. I'm sure he also has a powerful story. Yes, Christophe, let's do the countdown. Here we go. Three, two, one, start. Chef and everyone that is watching at home, I grew up in South of France, surrounded by water. All my life, I've been near, in, or on the water. The ocean generates over 50% of the oxygen that we breathe. The ocean regulates climate, and we all know how important it is to grow cacao. The ocean has been my source of inspiration for all the assignments. And the hexagon that you are noticing or the shape of life, or DNA. I could talk for hours to tell you my story, and um, I'm sure I will have time once the competition is over. But today, I want to leave you with one message that you can find in my wow assignment. There will not be hashtag tomorrow without the ocean. Take care of it. Thank you. Wow, 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 18 powerful stories. And I don't know if this was one of the most difficult assignments or not, but I know that it will be a difficult moment for the jury members because now they will decide who's going to be part of the 10 super finalists we will uh, announce very soon. But once again, give it up for our 18 finalists and their very personal creative chocolate stories. Please, a big round of applause. And that means that we are going out, so stay tuned for the announcement of the 10 super finalists. In meanwhile, please go check our website because there you can cast your vote for your favorite chef. You can find all recipes and more secret ingredients about this competition. See you very, very soon.